Hello everyone, my name is Raul, or Raised if you know me from my YouTube channel where I release a bunch of Godot tutorials. Anyway, welcome to my Kickstarter project exploring online multiplayer with Godot 4. Now, when it comes to making online multiplayer games, the process can be quite tedious and daunting for anyone that hasn't done it before. Heck, even if you've done it before, it can still be quite tedious. Now, when it comes to Godot, which is an awesome game engine by the way, there's a lack of resources on this matter. Now, there are some resources available, but they can be quite hard to understand and follow for a complete beginner on this subject. In fact, I myself did release a free tutorial series on a top-down dedicated server game. If you're interested, it's on my YouTube channel. <laughs> with that uh, shameless self-promotion out of the way, uh, what I aim to do with this course is to show you the basics and fundamentals of making online multiplayer games from Godot and its high-level multiplayer API, so that you can get up and running prototyping your online multiplayer games as soon as possible without having to worry about the complexity of advanced concepts such as user authentication and proper network architecture, which are outside the scope of this course. Now, how am I actually going to do this? Well, I will start by showing you the very basics by making this simple message app where you can scroll through existing messages and send and receive new messages. Uh, this project will show you how to connect a client to a server as well as the concept of RPC calls and remote functions. Now I will also show you how to use a plugin called Multirun to easily test your multiplayer projects. In this message app we will display the sender's name and message content and will show you all the messages from the others in a different color from our own. As a bonus it also has a dark mode so there's that I guess. Uh, from here uh, we will move on to the next project which will further reinforce what we learned in the previous session. Uh, this uh, next project will actually be an online multiplayer game that uses a dedicated server connection to connect the players called, for now, Slime Adventure because I know I'm very creative. <laughs> anyway, uh, this game is a Mario 35 like game where the last person alive wins. Now it's important to keep in mind that these projects are still in early prototype stages, uh, which uh, <laughs> explains some of the bugs that you may see here and there. Uh, and the prototypes were made in Godot uh, 3.3.3 and from the title of this Kickstarter, you will notice that it says Godot 4. Well, for now, I will be prototyping the projects in the current version of Godot, uh, and when Godot 4 releases, it will, I will update the projects to the new version. Uh, this just made more sense for me to do. Also, keep in mind that for this course, you should be somewhat familiar with Godot, and programming as very basic things won't be covered in full detail. Anyway, I hope you guys show your support for this Kickstarter, and together with your support, we can make this happen. Thanks, guys.